What's up, y'all? Ian here, Half Cut Garage. We're back again. Stay tuned. End of this episode, contest giveaway. We're gonna make that draw for hoodie, not this hoodie full of holes. She all welded out. Enjoy watching the Keel episode. Tacky tacky. Melted the rubber foot on my. Day 46, working on a six foot boat. Keel's cut now to the line ahead in the back. So uh, we'll just slide her into place. I prepped everything out. For today, some chines. Pretty simple. Line her up, same level. Leave yourself a little gap for some tacky tacky. Tacky tacky. And away we go. You can see I already got the other side done. Got the keel all welded out. Everything's now sitting in its place where it needs to be. We'll connect the dots here, get these lined up at the front. Chines started because from that point on the contours start to change on the boat. So uh, one side done, I'm gonna get the other side done up to the same point, and then we're gonna start pulling them at the same spot. So here we go, the slap side on. You'll see how much I struggle by myself. I didn't fill the struggle side, kind of got a system worked out. Got the other side tacked in place. We'll get this side tacked in place. We're gonna get air in there where our gap is right for our bottom side. And we can get a tack on there. Because remember, I'm a grinder, not a welder. So we got them side pieces all tacked on. We're gonna throw an eyepiece on here now. So all I've done is taken, I've cut this angle. It fits in here nice and snug. This boat will be towed a lot. So we got it here so it'll line up to the keel piece, come right up to the tip. All four corners will meet here. There you have it, tacky tacky.
We got our nose all welded up, a little bit to do on the outside, but I got the inside all welded up from here to here, because I can't get that with the operation that I got going on here. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start lining up just a couple of corners. It doesn't quite fit right here, which is why we haven't welded any of this. We're gonna have to pull this out a little bit. We're gonna have to pull this out a little bit and uh, everything should come together nice. So we'll put a couple of tacks on it and start prying her out a little bit. Always pay attention. Bottom's done. Everything I can do on the bottom is done. I still got these though. Second pass on my other vertical pieces. So I gotta go underneath. And if you've ever welded aluminum, it's not a good deal to breathe a lot of it. So you don't have one of them fancy exhaust extractor, blah, blah, blahs. This will be just enough weight to hold it roughly close to where I'm welding, suck out a lot of the fumes, keep the oxygen moving onto the inside, and we'll be golden. I'm not gonna set up a camera in there and lights and everything else for you to watch. So the next thing, I don't know what we're gonna do next. Sponson's on the back. I'll weld this, I'll meet you at the back. <laughs> I'm horrible at this build thing, I tell you. Anyhow, I just put the sponsons on. They're done. No fancy, shitty time lapse, nothing like that. Pretty simple. Start here, right at this corner, right here. Level that one out. That one, that one, that one. Then start pulling the rest around until it's even. Turned out pretty good. We jumped ahead, we're onto the swim deck now. We've got a couple of little spots we're gonna have to pull as we well, not a big deal. I cut a hole in here. I'm gonna have a, a hatch that bolts on, a cover plate that bolts on and seals. Um, just cause it's gonna be nice to have access here when it comes to putting a pump in and out with it being back here. Um, all this will work out good. We don't have to worry about this. Uh, we'll weld it all out. Just touch it there, weld there. Wow, how's that gonna seal you off? We've got our bar here. I already notched the bottom of it out. It's gonna cap it off. I still have to cut the sides off. And that'll be that. Bob's your uncle. And if your uncle's Bob, cheers. I do odd jobs absolutely everywhere to help absolutely anyone and everything for any reason. That being said, we're back. I don't know where I left off. Sponsons are on, swim deck, we just tacked it into place. Now we uh, pre-drilled the hole so we got nice round corners. We're gonna wind up building a plate that goes over top of this that bolts down. We're gonna get this all welded on, all along the edges, and then we're gonna start with our round bar, getting it to cut to size. What's up y'all? Ian here, Half Cut Garage. We are here, we got 94 entries on the wheel, spinning around. Uh, I think she said it's gonna spin for 15 seconds and then we're gonna have a winner. So without further ado, little clicky clicky. Drum roll, drum roll.
Oh, and we know who it is. Congratulations, Mr. Michael Normando. At this point in time, we'll already have been in touch with you. Thanks to everybody that participated and look forward to the next contest coming.